When you talk about the heart, you might come across these three terms, but what exactly do they mean? So these terms are used to refer to effects that some medications may have. So our first term is going to be inotropic. So what does this mean? So this is going to refer to the strength of contraction. So this refers to the contraction strength in our heart muscle. So how hard it's going to contract. That's inotropic. Chronotropic is going to refer to our heart rate. So chrono meaning time, you can kind of think of the heart rate and that'll help you remember that. Dromotropic is going to refer to the conduction speed. Conduction speed, so the electrical impulses, how fast they're going. And these can all be further divided into sort of two more categories of effects. So we can have positive or negative. So positive inotropic effect or negative inotropic effect. And these are all going to refer to, so for example, positive inotropic is going to mean more strength of contraction. Positive, we're adding, so it's going to increase the strength of contraction of the heart if it has a positive inotropic effect. If it's negative, it's going to decrease the strength of contraction of uh, the heart muscle. And so the same thing here, we have positive and negative. So positive, I'll just short in this. Positive, negative. So positive is going to refer to more heart rate, increase in heart rate, negative or obviously decrease in heart rate. And same thing here, we can have a positive or negative dromotropic effect from medications. Positive is going to mean increasing the conduction speed and negative is going to refer to decreasing the conduction speed of the heart. 